good day BCMJ. Right now, we are here at the City of Manila regarding the Memorandum of Agreement Signing Ceremony of the Universidad de Manila Technical Education and Skill Development Authority and the Public Employment Service Office of the Manila. Manila. And you will hear the opening message of City of Manila Mayor Honorable Francisco Isco Moreno Dumagosa. Thank you, Pakilala, sa ating pong binamahal na Presidente ng UDN, uh, Ms. Malu Tequia, at sa po ng aming mga kasamahang opisyales ng UDN, sa ating pong uh, TESDA Secretary Isidro La Peña, Deputy Director General Lina Sarmiento, Executive Director Juliet Orozco, and CR Director Florencio Sulico Jr., Manila District Director Maria Luders Villanueva, former Manila District Director Archie Grande, at uh, sa ating peso na si uh, Fernan uh, Bermejo, at uh, to the best sa family and peso family. Uh, welcome po kayo sa Maynila. Magandang araw po. Well, again, in line with our uh, direction, as a city, facing these challenges, the, effect, the socio-economic impact of this pandemic, your city continue to provide an opportunity, whether direct or indirect, opportunity to be given to our people, to those who lost their jobs in these trying times. Opo, at uh, sa maliit namin kaparanan, talagang itinutuloy namin yung nagninegosyo na naghahanap ng trabahante at trabahante na naghahanap ng trabaho uh, with the effort of the peso family, your city government. And I think we can take this opportunity again to provide a skilled individual in the coming years, months, so that hopefully, may I want yours, when, when we are about to restart the economy by achieving a goal of herd immunity after achieving that goal, we have to restart our economy. And when the economy is going to you know, grow again, it needs a lot of logistical uh, or skilled individual. And we are very grateful, I, your mayor, and Universidad de Manila, na nandito ngayon ng TESA para tulungan ng Manila. Kaya sa TESA, welcome back to Manila. <laughs> Opo, para sa kaalaman na uh, ni Secretary La Peña, eh noong 1988 ito, nandito na yung, uh, uh, yung TESA. Uh, 18, 19, 19. Oh, we didn't bring the place. Tapos nawala. Dahil hindi na po yata kayo ng pamahalaan ng lungsod ng Maynila. <laughs> but ako, I'm a believer of education. I'm a believer. In fact, until today, I continue to try to learn a lot of things. Economically speaking. Because uh, I have so much practical uh, experience in life, but that there is no harm in learning, uh, to look at the macro picture of creating good effects of creating policies and programs for a 2.4 million nighttime population of the city of Manila and about 3 million daytime population. That's why TESDA, for that matter, is one going to be the best asset of the city of Manila. And thank you for that opportunity for the people of Manila. On behalf of Batang Manila, Secretary Peña, at yung mga kasamahan, ay uh, nagpapasalamat kami. At uh, umasa naman kayo na pagkayari magkapag-aral, pagkayari may matutunan, may matamit na kaalaman, through TESA and UDN, ang mga mag-aaral namin, 
Ang obligasyon namin gagawin, bagamat hindi na kailangan, ngunit gagawin pa rin namin, ay ang itawid sila sa trabaho kanilang inaasang from the skill set na nakuha nila through UDN and TESDA agreement. So, pipilitin namin magbuti, maging maina, at magkaroon ng trabaho yung mga graduate natin under this agreement. Yan ang kailangan ni ng lahat sa mga darating na araw. Masakay at bilang panguli, ngayon, ang polisiya ng pamalang lungsod ay hindi lamang kalusugan. Now we are protecting since last quarter of December, last quarter of 2020. We've been addressing the pandemic at through two pros, life and livelihood. Yun ang aming trust. 2021. And this will add up to our plan by creating more skilled individuals in the city of Manila. Especially, later on, paglabas ninyo, namihan dito sa Bulwagan, at kayo sa Bulwagan Rodriguez, you will see the 10-year plan of the city of Manila. Creating a city within the city. If you are familiar with BGC, which I assume, because it's your neighboring office, in the game, that is about 146 hectares, if I'm not mistaken. And what you're going to see there is just one of this development consists of almost 400 hectares of Singapore light development of the next generations, generation of our citizen. Para sa mga anak at ako ng mga bata. Ibigay ka ang daming salamat sa inyo. Sakto ang kakailangan ninyo, mga 400,000 na manggagawa. And thank you very much, Tesla family. Maraming maraming salamat. Congratulations. You have witnessed the message of Mayor Escomoreno and now you will hear the message of Secretary Isidro Lapena, the Director General of TESDA. Thank you very much. Our Honorable Mayor Escomoreno Dimocoso, Madam Lourdes Malos Ayas, the President of the University of Manila, Mr. Fernand Bermejo, the Manager of uh, Public Employment Service Office in Manila. Mr. Picasso de la Cruz, the Head of UDM Center for Micro Credentialing and, in and Industry Training. Siya yung uh, isa sa mga una kong uh, namit na Universidad de Manila. Ang mga siya pa niyo. Other uh, City officials and executives uh, from the city of uh, Manila. Mm -hmm. The members of my party, led by uh, Deputy Director General uh, Lina Sarmento, the Deputy Director for uh, Operations, Regional Director uh, June Soligo, ng uh, TESDA National Capital Region, the Chief of Staff ng TESDA, the uh, Director Julia Torosco. Ang ating district director dito sa Manila ng TESDA, si uh, Lourdes uh, Villanueva. Our friends from the media, friends, ladies and gentlemen, magandang hapon po sa inyong lahat. Well, uh, una po, uh, gusto kong uh, iparating ang pasasalamat ng TESDA in behalf of Grateful TESDA. I would like to thank the Honorable Mayor for extending Manila's generosity and support to TESDA. Maraming salamat po, Mayor, for uh, the data assistance. Data assistance will be uh, reciprocated by uh, improving yung uh, services ng TESDA and extend the uh, training assistance to more uh, citizens ng Manila. 
At uh, yan po ay uh, pero po kaming uh, opisina ngayon uh, dyan sa May Pago. At uh, it's a, a small place, uh, opisina ng uh, Pista District uh, Manila. And uh, we have uh, PR training in uh, a year about 1,500 uh, Manilinos. This time, dahil uh, mayroon tayo uh, additional facilities, so we will have a uh, training uh, center at saka assistant center na rin. And um, yung mga taga dito sa Manila, hindi na kailangan pang pumunta sa ibang uh, sa ibang uh, test district dito sa Metro Manila para magkaroon ng training o kaya ng assessment. So dito na rin mismo sa Manila. So ang uh, mangyayari po, uh, with the with the um, three plus uh, two rooms na uh, uh, ipapa-accommodate ng uh, Universidad de Manila sa Testan, ay makakaroon po tayo ng um, uh, training center at assessment center na dito sa Manila. We will establish that. In fact, uh, uh, naka-organize na po tayo ng uh, ng uh, training center dito sa Manila and we have now the manpower complement mga kito po yan that uh, will uh, manage the uh, training operation ng TESDA dito sa Metro Manila ito pong uh, memorandum agreement that uh, we are signing today uh, marks uh, a uh, a landmark a milestone in ensuring the accessibility of technical vocation, vocational education, and training sa mga manilinyos. And uh, with this, uh, I was informed that uh, in uh, 2008, Testa Manila was already holding office at the ground floor of the same building. And uh, yung sabi ka ni Mayor, parang pinalis daw kami. Pero actually, hindi naman kami talaga umalis. Uh, Doon lang sa building. So, uh, we established yung uh, office dyan sa Paco. At we continue to serve uh, ang ating uh, mga kababayan dito sa Manila. E, um, Ayun namin na uh, yung amin ng pisahan na serbisyo sa mga taga Manila ay uh, matigil o mawala. Dahil alam namin na kailangan ng, ng mga taga Manila ang training para makatulong sa kanila na magkaroon ng trabaho o kayaan ng buhay. Wala naman na, uh, dyan sabi nga, wala naman diretsyo na mabigyan, mabibigyan na employment ng isang tao kung hindi niya alam ng trabaho. Kaya kailangan may train sila. Yan po yung trabaho po ng testa. At hindi lang basta-basta training. Training na that meets the uh, international standard ng uh, mga iba-ibang countries. In fact, ang uh, testa po ay metro ng tinatawag na Dublin, Dublin Accord. That sets the standard ng mga uh, skills uh, quality standard that uh, is the same as that of Australia. Japan, Korea, or Germany. So yun po yung, yung ating ginagawa. Kaya yung uh, mga graphic po ng uh, TESDA ay uh, mataas ang porsyento na ma-accept sa mga iba-ibang bansa because of that standard that uh, TESDA follows pag uh, uh, nag-trade tayo. Ang uh, ginagawa po ng TESDA training pagka-graduate, kailangan na magkaroon ng assessment. At doon malalaman kung talagang uh, nangimit na niya yung standard ng, uh, yung, ng skills na trinay niya and that skills uh, miss the standard of Dublin Accord yung international standard. This year, we will be uh, returning to yung dating uh, yung dating uh, pinaga uh, inoccupy ng TESDA sa University of uh, di Manila and in Santa Cruz, Manila. And certainly, 
more strategic location and more appropriate and accessible for the residents of Manila. More than that, so Paco. Yung Paco, gagawin namin uh, training at saka, assist, at saka assessment center po yan. Dito naman sa University of Manila, gagawin namin opisina ng district, ng TESDA district office. At the same time, may sa training, uh, training rooms din. Kaya, uh, noong nakita kami ni uh, Director no, sa University of Manila, ang uh, uh, pinakitin ko sa kanya yung request namin additional two rooms. Para, aside from the office, we will have a uh, training area no, sa University of Manila. And uh, at the rate uh, uh, of the, the rate of technology that is evolving, and as countries get ready for the fourth industrial revolution, we have to encourage the youth to develop various skills, especially those we call critical first century skills. At the same time, yung ating mga, mga magagawa na nawalan ng trabaho during this pandemic, and those uh, mga overseas workers natin that, uh, that uh, returned home who were repatriated because of the pandemic, eh, matutulungan natin sila by way of uh, re-skilling or auditory para magkaroon sila ng hanap buhay dito sa Pilipinas or when uh, the economy opens up, the economy of other countries opens up, they are ready for employment. And uh, and um, with uh, with that uh, preparation, I would say that the Amin Pong Testa will be more ready to provide the assistance that uh, is needed here in Metro Manila and. Uh, Ang, uh, again, uh, yung uh, sinabi ko kanina, kaya yung kasabihan na pag uh, binigyan mo ng ista yung isang tao, yan po ay pang isang araw laban. Pero kung uh, turuan mo siyang ng ista, yan po ay pang abang buhay. At pag sinabi yung turuan, yan po ay training. And when we talk about training, yan po ang mandato ng ista. Maraming salamat po. Regarding this uh, memorandum of agreement, this is not just the first time of the MOA of the TESTA to different LGU like Manila and we will hear the whole details of other provinces, city and municipality regarding this tripartite uh, memorandum agreement of TESTA. You will hear Secretary Isidro La Peña. Other provinces or municipalities who have a kind of assistance for this uh, livelihood, lalo na this yes. kind of pandemic. Saan po yung probably natin uh, mga magmumawa tayo for this uh, pandemic system? Uh, I-coordinate lang po natin si uh, General uh, at DDG uh, uh, Lina Sarmiento. So, pa sa uh, other uh, places, kasi siya po yung uh, deputy for operation. So, uh, uh, she's the one in charge of ganito. So, uh, i-link ko kayo, kayo sa kanya. Sige po, tumamsip na lang po. Thank you po. In line with this, you will hear some details from the director, assistant director general of TESTA, no other than Ms. Mila Sanyen. Saan po tayo magpagdain? Saan po kayo mga duplicate na nagagawin niyo all over other cities or provinces na katulad ito para makatulad kasi you are for the livelihood of lahat ng provinces and municipalities na po at saka po yung pag-agreement o makipag-partner sa PESTA. Ginagawa na namin ito. This is not the first time. So far po, ilan na po? Ako marami. Hindi ko masabi ngayon. Baka more than 60. If ever po yung mga interested, hindi pa nakakaalam na city, parapenses, o municipalities, ano po yung gano'n? Kasi ito ang interested sila na magsuon ng mga like this. Kailangan makausap nila yung district director or provincial director na 
Ay po, example po, bulakan ko, malapit dito. Marami na kami sa bulakan. Marami na po. Nakapag-inawas po namin sa atin. Pero kaming mga eskwelahan na sa bulakan eh. Ito kasing Manila wala. So meron kami sa Pagiginto and then meron kami sa Kalante. Dalawa na kayo. Sige, sige. If you're new on this channel, please subscribe Giant Tagalog at YouTube. The Memorandum of Agreement Signing Ceremony with the University of Manila Technical Education and Skill Development Authority and the Public Employment Service Office of Manila with the presence of the President of UBM, President Maria Lourdes Pedilla, Mayor City of Manila, Honorable Isco Moreno, and Secretary Isidro La Peña, the Director General of the ESCA. As uh, Mayor Isko said that uh, this trust with this pandemic, life and livelihood, this activity will be the worldwide and benefit the 2.4 million daytime population of Manila and 3 million nighttime population of Manila. This is MJ Alvina Balaguer of BZMJ Online, Matabunuhang Journalism, your happiness channel.